A community in Columbia County is honoring the life of an avid pilot who was killed earlier this year. Newswatch 16's Emily Kress shows us how a day at the Benton Airport is helping to support his family. The Benton Airport in Columbia County draws planes of all kinds for its fly-in events. On a nice day, we'll get 100 planes or more. Uh, we usually serve six, 700 people, but this year I think we're going to serve closer to 1,000. That jump in attendance for this fly-in is because it's dedicated to honoring the life of Ted Farwell, an avid flyer. Farwell was killed back in August after the crop spraying helicopter he was flying crashed in Mifflin Township. He missed a wire that he should have seen and, and it caught the helicopter. His mother, Pam Farwell, tells Newswatch 16 the love for flying runs deep in the family as Ted grew up watching his father spray the crops. That was always going on. Ted was number five of our six children, so Rick was spraying all that time. And so Ted saw that when he was growing up and always wanted to fly. It was just, uh, it was a terrible thing. And we think about it all the time. The family is very close-knit, you know, the, the, the Farwell family. And uh, it is, it was, they're taking it in stride, but it, it's, it's terrible. For people like Bob Brewington, president of the Benton Airport Association, Ted was a good friend. Brewington showed Newswatch 16 this plane that Ted helped paint. Ted's family says even though he didn't fly out of the Benton Airport often, his impact soars through the community. It means a lot. We've had lots and lots of support for his service, for his calling hours, and uh, support of our family. And, and this is a community event that has turned into a, a great event for him as well. Proceeds from the benefit will help support Farwell's wife and four children. Emily Kress, Newswatch 16, Columbia County.